And we're back! Yay! Still fighting! We've been doing this for like, I don't know, 24 hours, 46 Yes, we've been on this couch for the next for the last 24 hours. Welcome back to Gamer Palette with your host, Alan and Rosewit. Fallen and Rosie right here. Oh, I didn't work on the introduction. <laughs> Yay! I found a Gemerald! A Gemerald! A Gemerald! <laughs> it's just an attack plus one. I'm sorry, I just got that. I am so slow. <laughs> Wait. What is a Gemerald? Because I've heard about that before, but like... Oh, Gemerald. Because like, I thought that was like a parody of like, gems and emeralds. Gems and emeralds. I mean, I know an emerald is a gem, but still, like, I thought that was like a parody where you just combine the names. Like you could have a Rubberol, or a Saffirol, or something. Hold on. I was like, com oh. Com oh wait, just, wow, it's tired brain said that wrong. A gem fire or a gem bee is probably what I should have said instead oh, of- Oh, Quantum Gemeral is something from Futurama. Yeah. I remember that from Futurama. Oh, okay. And now we can go behind the skeleton door with the skeleton key. Okay, no, here it is. Cool. You cannot search that up, search that on Google Images without uh, having C search on. Don't take my advice, people! Wait, what? You cannot uh, search that search up general on Google Images without some stuff coming up. Okay, then. Nice to know! Now you uh, guarantee that people will do that. Okay. Oh, yeah. I found a statue. Yes. Cut and run. And shank and run. And stab and run. And shank and run. I feel like you just pick out this one. That's my Dark Souls formula right there. <laughs> well, I mean, you can't kill it in one go. Exactly. Yay. That's probably basically the, the formula for most Dark Souls monsters right there. Just peck and go. Alright, I got a bench, another bench, and... Ah! Well, time for Zhao. I want Zhao's weapon. It's, like... It's slingshot. shot. Yeah, but it's low. Well, no, but she only fires one sling at a time. So, like, this is the reason why I love her. You can basically just completely control when you repair. Because you just have to wait till you hit one. And you're good. Oh no! Extreme damage! And I'm going to do that because the thing is, one thing, even though it does only fire one at a time, for some reason it does like a stupid thing where it'll do, oh, it took two this time for no good reason. Yeah, like I just saw that right there and reminded me to shut the heck up because I don't know what I'm talking about half the time when I'm tired. Oh, there we go. Uh, die. Just die, man. Quit dodging. Crap. At least he doesn't block all the time. Done. Murdered. And this is good for her leveling up, right? Yep, and look what I'm doing. I'm running faster now, because I'm using the feather. Whee! So, oh, I'm going slow. Fast, slow. Fast, slow. Fast! What are you? A bat! Now I don't even have to wait to do, like, a special thing. Zhao can kill these things so good. Murder so good and so righteous. Oh. All right then. Now it's just a matter of opening everything up, getting all my presents, and leaving. <gasps> Premium. Liar. So yeah, uh, one thing also that you'll find interesting: Zhao's special thing is that she can jump. Right. For, well, for Toen, he has a special thing that he has had all along that you don't get to see very easily. Really? Yeah. You know those Atla? Yeah. I can't open it. Oh, I just wasted a shot. Oh no, Slingshot can't touch Atla. Oh, so that's his ability to give me only Atla. Oh, there is another monster. Die! Murder! Yeah, because he has the Atla Millie, he's actually able to open them. And I just touched another Atla. Or not touched it, I guess, according to the thing. Will you die already? Will you be so kind as to die? Red right 2. Yep. What did you do to all your prayer powers? Yep. I don't think you should use your prayer powers like that. What? I don't think you should use up your prayer powers like that. Well, I mean, that's the only thing I can do. I don't have another weapon for her. Oh my god. There we go. And money. Holy crap. Those things are just damage soaking, aren't they? Oh, yeah. They have way too much health, they're really popular, uh, show up way too much, and they don't do anything in particular. I got trees! <laughs> <laughs> now 
now I can do landscaping. And a lamp. Lamperoo. What? Lamperoo. Oh. Okay. Fun. Yeah. Oh. Own that house. Okay, that is someone else's house, and that's really awkward that they gave me All Net's house. Really? Yeah, because I don't have All Net or her brother or their llama. Oh, I know I have their llama. Yeah, I've got All Net's llama, and that's it. I can put their llama in their house. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> but I don't have them. So the llamas are gonna eat everything in the house. Pretty much. Here's my not girlfriend. Wait, that's Jean. Oh, it's Paige, yeah. Yep, Paige. Jean is my cousin. Oh. Which is an interesting thing, because, like, that's another thing in this story, what? is Toen's dad never shows up. Oh, that's the thing with most anime heroes, really. Well, here's the other weird thing. He's not even referenced. Yeah, it's true. They, you no, know, that was true. In some animes, they will reference their dad's going on a business trip or something, or died, at least. Yeah, like, for Toen's father, just... Toen's father's never existed, nor even referenced as having existed. I wonder why is that for the most anime's? Well, they don't like to reference the parents at all, especially the dad. The dad gets the shaft most of the time. <laughs> well, that happens more in video games. For, like, it depends, like, on which culture, too, because, like, Disney is infamous, as we all know. For parent killing? Well, for mommy not being there. The dad can be there in quite a few instances, but mom... If she's there, it's important. She can't just be there half the time. Really? Yeah. There are so many times where the mom is basically used as either, oh, I'm dead and I'm going to stay dead, or, oh, here's something important. i got to move you around, and then i got to put you down here, because he wants to smell all Nets cooking. Right. And all Net wants to be away from the Macho Brothers. Really? Yeah. She doesn't like the Macho Brothers, but they're already in the corner of the village, so it'll be fine. The person I really need to worry about will be my Aunt Laura, who wants to be away from the mayor, who I can't move. So I'll have to move Aunt Laura over here. Okay. So, there's like a, tons of small little things like that. Anyway, I've got road! Boom! How much road... Oh... And I'll connect to the mayor's house just to be nice to him. Oh, I don't have enough to get to Paige. Oh, well. <laughs> She's your not-girlfriend anyway. <laughs> yeah, I might, as well, I might as well visit her. Oh, no, that's just her dad. Dyke! <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll buy to the parent thing, really. Oh, yeah. Parents, not that often. I know parents are coming. Oh, okay, good. I just got the snowbreaker. I was worried there because I'm going to... I will admit, I'm going to scum save for some items after we're done recording. Right. Sword, you're alive. I was worried, thinking something happened to you because of me. But thanks goodness, you're okay. How's I repair no moon? Hmm, I don't know. You better ask Dad about that. Can I touch him? No. <laughs> don't forget a lamp. It's scary at night without a light. Oh God. So is she really the not love interest in the whole game? Pretty much. Like, that entire opening, like, portrays her as, like, being a super-duper love interest. And, like, you even see her say such nice things to you and all that stuff. But the thing is, she doesn't really matter after you're done building the village. Like, this is the last time I need to ever care about her. Like, well, is there, like, some special, like, scene in the opening and the ending where they can, like, get together or something like that? Nope. Seriously? Like, Toen is not that relevant to the ending. Like, no one is relevant to the ending. Really? Except for a certain extra character. But here's what your not-girlfriend does do that's awesome. Sword! Good to see you. I made a new pouch. It's for you. Looks like it can carry a lot of items, huh? And now I can carry <laughs> more things. Okay, I wish you luck, Sora. Go for it! And that's like the last time I ever have to talk to her. Oh my god. 
I do not have to talk to my not girlfriend ever again. Like, ever. And I got the request done because all I had to do was have it next to the pond. Do I have the pond set up properly? Okay, no, I don't. Uh, I'm gonna move it. So, there we go. Oh my god. Because yeah. I want this to be pointed out. Just because, you know, I, I like it looking nice. Okay. But, yes. Let's see. Do I have anything else I need to fix? Chiamara. I got all that done. Uh, config. Just all Nets house. I've got my aunt and my cousin, but they aren't going to be doing anything anytime soon. Oh, I have trees. I want to put a tree here. And oh, a tree just, uh, next block to up. my house. And, oh, wait. I just realized something. What's up? I don't want my house next to Fatty. God, Alan! I don't like him. <laughs> you have his immense hatred. I don't like for, him so much. For useless characters. You know what? Yeah. Fatty doesn't, Fatty doesn't get any trees. Holy crap! Kim. <laughs> Holy crap! He can stay over there for all I care. So you put a moat around his house? Yep. I'll put that there. And then... You know what? I'll put my house actually next to my not-girlfriend's. Because I like it better that way. Right. And there'll be other houses I can put nearby uh, Old Man Gaffer. Old Man Gaffer. What other houses do I have? I've Nothing. got a bridge. Nothing. Nothing. I've got the small windmill, which I usually like to put over here. I like to have like these small windmills like over here on like, the northern side of town. What was really the purpose of windmills? What? What was really the purpose of windmills? Power generation? Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. That was a slow moment for me. <laughs> no, it's fine. All right. Because I so... only think of the like, when it comes to power, when it comes to wind power. I can only think of the new turbine and turbine windmills. I'm gonna put some tree. Oh well, no, that that tree shouldn't be there. Oh well. Let me go ahead and move that tree. We're gonna put it next to my not girlfriend. Uh huh. Uh, macho and co macho down there. They don't have anyone that cares about them. Oh. I know it's sad, but it's true. I can move this. Get that so that means maybe we can eventually build a road to Macho and Co Macho. Cause screw Fatty Momo. Oh, you just got that burning hatred. It's a hunk of hunk of burning hatred. <laughs> a hunk of hunk of burning. Hey, you got his house. He gave his house a river and a, and a bunch of trees. <laughs> Oh my god! There. I'll probably repurpose this later, but I don't want him coming over to my house anytime soon. Oh my god! Actually, you know the I game's don't... just gonna randomly place him in your, in your house? No. He's very unlikely to travel far from his house. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh, because he's fat. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, oh, because he's fat. Damn you, game! Yep. And now, to get to his house, I have to go through an entire hurdle of going through woods and past rivers. Now I can be at his house. But I don't want to be, so I'll go back through those hurdles, and now I don't have to talk to him anymore. I don't have to talk to anyone anymore. Oh my God, Except for don't... old man Gaffer. I need to talk to him. Give me your shit! <laughs> Alright, I want to... Bye. I have plenty of antidotes. I need the repair powder. Alright, good. Yep, I'm done. Alright, time to look at my weapons. I'm gonna repair this. And then we want to repair this. The wooden slingshot. Yep. And I'm gonna have to get that up to level 5 too, because when I get an actual good weapon for Zhao, I want her to actually be able to use it. Oh, yeah. I just want to buy one more. There we go. So as Zhao dies in the, in the dungeon, does it automatically switch back to you, or is the game over automatically? Um, actually, I had to leave the dungeon and give up half my money. You just reminded me of something important. Okay. I want to buy. See, I am helpful. Stand-in powder. And really, I only need like one of it. I'll buy two powder. and get a revival powder. Can change. 
Oh, what that does is it allows me to actually switch characters if a character gets knocked out. Okay. This allows me to revive a knocked out character. So they're very important. Okay. Anyway. You always want to have your life bottles in your like, whoa. We can do more next time, okay? All right. See you guys. That's it for this episode. All right. See ya. Have a good night. Or good morning, good afternoon. Whatever, fuck you. Good night! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a great way to say goodbye. <laughs> yes. Well, don't worry, we love you bonuses. <laughs>